guys welcome back to my channel so new trend um, I don't know what it's called someone will have to let me know what it's actually called um, but this is my chimera gel I think that's how you pronounce it chimera gel from incandescent shine and my eternal darkness gel polish from incandescent shine just gonna give these a mix together Little, till I get a bit of transparency, not too transparent. Um, yeah, and then I'm gonna do a full nail of this. This time around, I did do this base a little too thin, I think. It was definitely thicker on my first attempt and I managed to get a lot more gold come through on my first attempt. So yeah, note to self next time to do the base a little thicker. So I'm going to do a full nail of this and then I'm going to come in with a bit of cling film, pop that over the top um, not in any particular way, just place it on um, and then I'm going to take a dotting tool and just push, pull, prod wherever I want this. I do pull and push this cling film a little bit. I feel like it creates the, I don't know, the, sh the sharper edges a bit better. Um, so I've cured that for 60 seconds. The only thing is with pushing and pulling it, you do get a little bit of cling film stuck. So I'm just gonna fight here with it for a minute um, until I get it out and then I'll be back. So this is a gold pigment I had from Lindsay Douglas. Uh, this is from when I did makeup a couple of years ago because I used to be a makeup artist before I became a nail tech. So I'm just popping some of this on the tacky layer of the Chimera gel. And then I will give it a dust off. Um, and I don't know, I think I don't, I can't find my brush here. I brought a new one because my 10 month old, no, sorry, 11 month old, has took it upon herself to lose my brush and my nail scrubber. So I've had to buy two new ones today. So yeah, just giving it a dust over and then I'm gonna come back in with that same Chimera gel black that I created um, I haven't made any more, it's exactly the same. I'm um, going to cover this and then again cure for 60 seconds in my LED lamp. So I went off camera and I just um, refined the, the sides a little bit again and then I'm taking my 100 grit file and I'm just going to keep filing off the top of that until I start to reveal the gold, the gold lines a bit more. Um, you can see that it's coming through a bit more. I will go off camera in a second and finish this with my e-file because it was taking a little too long with the hand file. Please excuse the horrible green yellow fingernail there. I let my friend who's never done nails before have a go at sculpting a nail on me and I'm in the process of removing it. It was a really long stiletto. Anyway, so I filed that and now I'm taking my Tack Free Top Gloss from Incandescent Shine. Doing a coat on that. This top gloss has got a little bit of glitter in it, gold glitter. It's beautiful. And then cure that for 60 seconds and this is the end result guys. So I hope you like it. I'll try and insert some pictures and I'll see you next time. Bye.